if m times the mth term of an ap is equal to n times the nth term show that m plus nth term of an ap is zero here they told m times the mth term equals n times nth term so m times mth term is nothing but a plus m minus 1 into d equals n times nth term is a plus n minus 1 into d next m into a plus m minus 1 into d is md minus 1 into d is minus d n times a plus n times d is nd minus 1 into d is minus d now if you multiply m times a m a m into m m square d minus m d n a n into n n square d minus n d now m a plus m square d minus m d will bring all the terms towards LHS minus n a minus n square d plus n d equals 0 now first write a terms m a minus n a then write all the terms with d plus m square d minus n square d minus m d plus n d equals 0 now here in these two terms if we we'll take a common m minus n in remaining four terms you have can take d common so i'll be left with like m square minus n square minus m plus n equals zero this is most important step now next one so a into m minus n plus d into here if you will observe this is in the form of a square minus b square so i can write a plus b into a minus b and in these two terms i can take minus common then you will be left with m minus n this one step is like most important minus if you will take common minus m minus n because if you multiply minus m minus into minus plus n now a into m minus n in these two terms you can take m minus n common if we'll take d into m minus n common here you'll be left with m plus n and here everything you took common so minus 1 next step in these two terms see you can take now m minus n common if you take m minus n common here you will be left with a plus d into m plus n minus 1 equals 0 so same step will write here m minus n into a plus m plus n minus 1 into d d i am writing it then equals 0 now m minus n if i will transpose i will be left with a plus m plus n minus 1 into d equals 0 by m minus n 0 by m minus n is 0 a plus m plus n minus 1 into d equals 0 now here this is nothing but a m plus nth term so because in place of n we have m plus n so a m plus n is 0 because nth term formula is a plus n minus 1 into d this is the formula for nth term of an ap now see in place of n we have m plus n so a m plus n is 0 